up one I done went up a new level, they say I am faded Head in the glass, ain't coming down, gon' not get medicated Paper chasing, I gotta get it, ain't got time for wait Heard they sleeping, guess they exhausted, it's about time I wake No, they want me to follow them. Before I get started with this video I must say, if you are someone who is returning You watch my channel all the time Hit the like button, y'all. That like, that comment, all that watch time that y'all give me helps my channel. Watch the full video, no skipping. Make sure you hit the like button now for you won't forget. I appreciate you. Let's get it. Welcome back, Best Uni Crew. It's your girl. So I'm up early this morning. Um, bored as usual so I'm going to try and do a rolling tray but this time instead of me using transfer tape I'm going to use the laminating sheets with the AV brand uh, shipping labels sublimation paper my laminating sheet pouches and an image of my choice also tray from Dollar Tree uh, sizing I did I think I did entirely too big but I just wanted to make sure it was gonna cover the tray so the sizing I did was 9.28 width and I did 12.5 I think height and I shouldn't because it looks too long but we're just gonna work with it anyway so got my laminated sheets and my Avery sheets here it's my Avery sheets I am going to have to laminate both because to some effect my image is split in half. A lot of y'all want to know how to do that. I got a couple of videos showing that. All you do is slice your picture in half on Cricut Design Space. Make sure all of it is highlighted. Get the sizing that you want. And then lock your box and make you no know, print. So we're just going to do our laminating part first. Grab the laminated sheets, pull it apart. Matte side go down, shiny side go up. So, go ahead and press this for no more than probably like seven to eight seconds. We'll probably do. press it my heat press is up to three nine well it's jumped to four but it's supposed to be like 400 degrees so about that seven o'clock okay so all we want to do is rub it I like to let mine cool. I don't know about nobody else. So I sit that all to the side and I'm gonna do the next one. Next side down, shine this side up. My timer is set for six seconds. I think I went 10 on the last one, so. Just let it go for the second. Make sure I rub it. And then I'm gonna sit this one to the side. So now I'm just gonna cut the image. My bad. It is entirely too early for me. Um, instead of you cutting the image, you can just place the whole image down on your laminating sheet and shipping that and then cut it all at one time. I don't know what the heck I was thinking just then. So. So, 
pray for the best. I'm going to press. I'm gonna leave that down for 60 seconds. Very vibrant. I printed the cricket. Hopefully it don't, don't cause a problem, but we'll find out. So now I'm just going to cut and I'll be back. Okay, so we're just going to try. That's all we can do. So I'm going to pull the back and off the Avery label. I'm just going to pray because y'all already know how this label paper is. So far, I'm feeling like, eh, you know what I mean? Because of the stickiness. But, I feel like please take your time, be careful. And it's, it's not... It's bending, but it's like, it's kind of plastic feeling. So, I feel like, take your time. I know you know your girl got some heavy hands, and it looks like I'm beating the shit out of it, but <laughs> I'm trying to pull up and tug and hold it up so I can be able to push it down in the corners and all that good stuff. So, I think another way... Uh, would be pretty if we tried the printable vinyl, not printable vinyl, but the laminated paper and the the uh, 651 Oracle brand vinyl. I think that'll be cute. So if any of y'all try that, tag me. I would love to see it. And I'm just doing this because I hate doing resin, but the way this gonna look so far, it'll be pretty. But will the sticky hold up? That's the problem for me. I feel like it might. I don't know. I'm going to leave it a couple days and see will it come up because sometimes this stuff will come up on its own. But I feel like if you use a spray adhesive, maybe it'll stay, stay. You know what I'm saying? So try something like that too. I would try to spray the bottom of it before I lay all this right here down. And then, I don't have any, but that was just a suggestion. Okay, so now we're just going to try and line it up with this one. Oh, yeah, I can see. Sometimes I'll be all like the camera and I don't know it until I go back and look at it. You don't want to put it on top of each other because it won't lay down for show then. They're sticky. For some reason, don't stick good to that plastic. Laminating, whatever it is. It might be a tad off, but we're just going to wing it. I feel like I will have to put some double-sided tape down on the edges for it to stay down or something. I'm going to figure something out. You know I am. I think this will cut the game in half. Or you can use that waterproof paper or something everybody keeps telling me about. I just like to try stuff, y'all. I know it's stuff out there that you can buy that's already doing the work for you. I just like to try different ways and let learn my own way. This one, I didn't bring it down. I should have brought this one down more. I didn't think it was going to be big enough, so I didn't want to, you know, leave something out of her body, but I can't get it back up. Okay, well, if I get it up, it's going to rip, so we just got to go with it, and we'll just piece it. Okay, I got some double-sided tape, and I'm just going to wing it, because <laughs> I need this to lay down. So I'm going to do this piece here and pray it works. So I'm just going to put some here on the um, on this corner, and let's see where that helps it lay down. If it do, then that's great. If it don't, it is what it is. 
we just know next time to just do this part just for the center. I did a round one like that. And a couple of y'all seen that on live. But I think I did it with... I think I did the same way. Okay, that helped. So, I would say use a double side adhesive or a spray adhesive to make it stay stay. That's too much work for me though, so we have to figure out something else. holding it down pretty good okay let's see so we need to work this part down and try to bootleg it try to get that to lay down try to do like a Double side of tape, put it right there, and then make that lay down like that. And that's what we do, get a little piece just to make it stay on down there. Boy, y'all know you there be nigga rigging. I ain't gonna even lie to you. Let me try and make it do what it do, baby. Yeah, see? You know your girl come up out the camera real quick, like. Too much work to go through, I understand that, but just in case you had to. This is the way you can do it. <laughs> Just make it do what it do. Use what you got. Like I said, if y'all want the images, I'm going to start selling them because I done told a lot of people where to get them from and they don't want to make them. I'm not about to do the work for you. So, once again, you can get these images off IMVU. You can make them yourself. But if you don't want to make them yourself, send me my $2 to my cash app or inbox me. Find me on Facebook or um, Instagram on Godfrey1. I will send you the images. All they are is print. They're not no SVGs or no uh, all the other extra stuff. I just I send it to you if you want it. It just be the girl. If you want this design that I got with the background, you can, I send you that too. But you got to be specific. Oh, let's try to cut close as possible. So damn near cutting the tray. That's how close I be. Okay. I'll just try to get it down. Make sure I clip what's extra. So I'm gonna turn it over and get a little extra off like that without cutting my tray up. waste out my tape y'all because this is just something to practice with i was just taking a chance so that little double side of tape is high as hell i got it from michael's probably like 6.99 probably didn't use a coupon so i got some for four and stuff like that so okay guys on this opinion now you can't see my flaw because of my lining <laughs> I messed up just a tad, but you get the point, right? You get the idea. You see her. Because I don't want to use epoxy. So y'all have a blessed day. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And I'm out.